You're right then, Mark here um, from Six Plus, going over a bit of a heresy uh, discussion slash rant video. Um, anyone that's into heresy, 30k, whatever you want to call it, Age of Darkness, would probably have known about this post now for the last couple of days, and that is now you can get in down the line you're going to be able to get chainsawed wielding mark six marines when i first saw this post i thought oh they're doing a plastic kit to to be uh, the spoilers that's what they're called and then when i read through it i am now completely disheartened because it is a four-year-old kit upgrade kit all right um that only does five marines all right you only got enough bolt pistols for five marines chain swords for five marines sergeant big ass chain sword all right they do say this can add uh some variety for your sergeants your command squads your veterans fine but this is four drilled now, the way they were saying it before was all, un all unique Legion-specific stuff was going to be four-drilled. Anything that was generic was going to be plastic. So they've done the special weapons, the heavy weapons, as plastic that you can buy them. Why did this need to be four-drilled? This is not specific for any Legion. And I just thought, I wouldn't do a post straight away. I'll just actually double check some things before I sound like an absolute idiot. But yeah, this is a, this is a four-year-old kit and that's all you get in it. All right. Now the track record for their pricing for four-year-old is not great. All right. Because if you go onto the four-year-old website, oh, five axes, 1650. Um, the, the Legion specific thing is 32 quid, fine. But, same again. Five weapons, 1650. It's not looking that great. Wait a minute. Oh, apologies, I clicked too far forward. 1650, 1650, 1650. Everything that is like for five strong unit is 1650. Now, I can understand if this is... Legion specific stuff like the Imperial Fist, Sons of Horus, World Eater, uh, yeah, World Eaters, Death Guard. Fine, because that's what they were saying at the beginning of this whole new addition to the Heresy game, which everyone was thumbs up. Everyone is thumbs up. Now, some of you may be watching this video and stuff and going, well, Mark, it's going to be cheaper anyway than going Forge World. Is it? Is it really going to be cheaper than going forward or doing this route? Because a despoiler squad is 44 quid for five of them, which is not cheap. Not disputing that at all. Not cheap at all. But you can't take despoiler squads in less than 10 man squads. So that's 88 quid there you got to spend. Very expensive, in my opinion. Very, very expensive. So now. If you get your, now this is all from GW, I know you can go third party uh, retailers and stuff like that to get it cheaper, but I'm going core GW pricing. So let's get the Mark VI Tactical Squad here, 47.50 plus, we want a 10 man squad, alright, so it's going to be 16.50 plus 16.50. You're spending 81 quid. If it comes out the same bracket, same pricing as they've done before. Don't get me wrong, you've got 10 spare tactical marines. But that's still a lot of money that you got to buy without going and breaking a box set down. You know, let's say you still got the 10 marines for 20 quid plus 16 plus 16. Let's say that. That's still 52 quid. That is cheaper than four drilled. I'm not disputing that. That's 30 quid. But I'm seeing so much stuff now where 
people are voicing their frustration about this because this was not what people were thinking. And some people were saying, well, if you can't afford it, just don't buy it. No, that mentality needs to stop completely because it's complete it's really insulting i genuinely do think that in that personality that kind of mindset is very insulting because you're allowing stuff like this to happen i would love to have a 10 man uh, squad of despoilers just to have them that i could put them in my army if i wanted to you know one game i may throw them in a rhino and shoot them up the board but i'm not putting them in there if it's £16.50 for five arms or five bodies, to put it in retrospect, you go on to Etsy, first thing I found, eight quid for five bodies or five limbs. What's going on? All right. And you may be saying, oh, Mark, it's just it's just a game and stuff like that. Yeah, but when you let things like this keep happening, it's like, what, what, what's the point? Because... GW did do their special weapon set, which you got 10 of each. You got five different special weapons. You got 50 of them. No, was it 50 or 60? 60 of them, sorry. So, cool. Let's have that 26 divided by 6. So that's cool. You're paying just over 4 quid. For a 10 man squad. They've done this. So why can't they do it with other stuff? And I know you people are going to be saying. Oh that they're looking at releasing more plastic infantry. Is in production. Not just tanks. I don't see the point in this then. If they are doing a 10 man squad. Or a 20 man squad or whatever. Of the spoilers or destroyers maybe. Breachers. Things like that. Why do that? Just why? Okay. This need this kind of stuff needs to stop. And I know there's the people out there going, "Oh well, it's an expensive hobby, it's a luxury, and all this and all that." But it doesn't need to be. They've shown it with their pricing before. If they went, "Oh, it's fifteen quid for ten arms," I think a lot more people will be. Um, accepting of it. I know I'm second guessing the 1650, but their track record that they show with all their other gear from Forge World, I don't think it's going to be any less than 15 quid. Hold my hands up if it's like 10, 12 quid. Fine. GW, you're heading in the right direction, but I don't think this was the right call. Genuinely don't. But um, I'm just voicing my frustration because it just seems to be very strange sideway action it, it, like people wanted combat uh, marines in their heresy and i know i'm waffling off uh waffling on but this is something that's really rubbed me up the wrong way um but i'm just gonna plod along with my kit bashing that i'm already doing for my bit slot but if someone's starting out and they don't have bits it's gonna get expensive very quick but anyway um I shall let you all crack on with the rest of your day. I do somewhat apologise for the rant, but I just needed a voice out there being like, this is just not acceptable. I know they're a business, but this is just not acceptable in my eyes. But anyway, you all take care of yourself as much as you can. Um, any comments down below, please be, um, please be as courteous as possible. You know, I know sometimes it can get really, really heated. Let's just keep it as um, constructive um, talking as possible and go from there. But anyway, you all have a fantastic rest of your day and I'll catch you in the next one. Take care. Thank you.